Hello friends. So as you're seeing from the title, this is yet another discount haul. My assistant is about to join us, I do believe. Pudge, would you like to come sit with everyone? Come on, we'll get on up here. Okay, we're back for take two. So, as I was saying, today's video is yet another discount haul. Discount hauls are hauls that I pull from thrift stores, Walmart, sales, dollar stores like Dollar Tree, Dollar General, because those are the only two we have here, because I live in the middle of nowhere. Um, but these are some of the finds that I found in the last few days, just on my out and abouts. So the first part of today's discount haul comes from my favorite local thrift store. Now my favorite local thrift store is actually about 45 minutes away because I live in the middle of nowhere. So it is in Carson City, Nevada. It is called Classy Seconds and their charity benefits women and children and really I guess anybody. I don't think it's just women, but that's the primary demographic who are escaping situations involving domestic violence and spousal abuse. So I love shopping from them for a few reasons. One, the store is huge and it's beautiful and it's clean and it smells good, which is rare for thrift stores. But two, everyone in there is so incredibly friendly. You always feel like you're walking into your aunt's garage and you're just picking up what you want whenever you feel like it. So I love visiting Classy Seconds and they have finally brought out all of their Easter and spring specialty decor. This whole bag only cost me $4.50. Not that that matters, it's coming from a thrift store, but the finds to me are worth much more. So I was very excited to get them. And they also have random themed sale days. So you'll walk in there and there'll just be a sign on the door like, all decor 50% off out of nowhere. And I think today was one of those days. So the first thing is this cute planter steak. It's a jumping bunny with little flowers on it. And they originally had it marked for $3.49. I don't think that is what they charged me. I don't really ask questions. They just kind of type numbers in and go with it. So I'm very excited to have this delightful piece. And she is so cute. She's also a little bit glittery. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm planning to put this on my barrels right next to my front door. So this one was a great find. But the next two go together. I'm a big fan of books. I'm a big fan of bookends, and I'm a really big fan of these. It is a bunny bookend. It says bunny on it. It is so cute, and there are two of them. So it's like a little city bunny with some grass and, or with some carrots and some grass, and then just the book, and you can put it, you don't have to use bookends for books. I often put mine against the side of a cabinet or the side of a wall or whatever in a corner. So that's the first one. And then it's twin. This hair is something else I know, but who doesn't have one of those messy bun days? It's twin is this one. So look how cute my two little bunnies are. And I'm so excited to add these to my collection. So the next store I went to was Walmart. And my Walmart, I don't know if I missed the Easter rush or if maybe they didn't get all their Easter, but it feels like Easter was very lackluster. But I finally found some window clings and I'm gonna use these for the window in my stepdaughter's room to go with all of the paper flowers that we're making. So I think these are gonna be really cute to decorate with. And I just thought they were so whimsical and like delicate and they look hand painted and they're beautiful and I love them. So for 98 cents, you literally can't go wrong, beats Dollar Tree. The next thing I got, in my last discount haul, I talked about the fact that for some reason, I went to Walmart and needing ribbon and I only grabbed one spool of 98 cent ribbon and today I had to remedy that. So I went back to get more 98 cent ribbon, except for they were also out of the ribbon and this was the only one they had left. It's this yellow gingham with the blue truck and cute little eggs. I love this ribbon. Honestly, this is the one I wanted. So I'm kind of glad it was the only one they had. But seriously, I don't know what is going on with the supply chain. I don't know if it's, you know, related to the illness that's going around. We just had a very near miss with the camera. <laughs> um, <laughs> my quality control director is rearranging things. So yeah, so I snagged this one 
And then last up, I got two more toy clearance spines for my stepdaughter for her Polly Pockets. And these were 50 cents a piece. So I got both of them. So one is a cute little spaceship and it has um, a little brown haired girl in it. And then the other one is and this one's on a necklace and this one is a ring and it's like a soft drink cup with a little blonde haired girl and she is starting to collect Polly Pockets so these will be super cute to surprise her with. Next, because I was working on a couponing hack video to review some couponing apps, I went to both Walmarts and at the other Walmart, I found this super cute hedgehog fleece throw blanket and my stepdaughter loves hedgehogs so I had to snag this for her and this was only $2.00. This style of just basic fleece throw, they have them pretty much year round for $2 and they're in just a big bin in the random middle of the store. And I love seeing, I love seeing if there are any holiday themes or colors. So this one will go great for the rest of spring and honestly well into summer until we put her rodeo blankets out. And then the last find, I am a collector of flowers, but only flowers on clearance. And I got, all of these <laughs> so once again the floral clearance queen strikes <laughs> he is something else today yes do you like these do these meet your quality control standards are you checking with the vice president of this operation what do you think thank you thank you for the kisses okay can you get down please i'm really worried you're gonna jump in this bucket it could be interesting I'm keeping this in for sure. Okay, so these are not singular picks. These are bouquets. You can easily cut these apart. Oh, also how cute is this bucket? This came from my mom. They're moving. So she's basically letting me have lots of random things. So anyway, these bouquets, and there are a lot of them, um, were not in the marked clearance section. So I always tell people this. Let me just dig through the jungle here. So I always tell people this, um, download the Walmart app onto your smartphone, scan in the store, right? So what I learned from my great big clearance hunt back in January is that when you see items, the price maybe may not always be what it claims to be. Hidden clearance at Walmart is a huge deal and it is all over the store all the time. So what I recommend doing, if you're in the floral section and you see something you like, pick it up, scan the barcode. On the Walmart app, just scan the barcode. I would say about half the time I scan an item in the floral clearance, and this is not just at my Walmarts, this is literally at every Walmart I have gone in and tested this in. About half the items I scan are not priced as marked. These on Walmart's website are 582 a bundle, which let me tell you, for a bundle that is this big, right? At Hobby Lobby or Michaels, you're looking at 15 or $20 for a bundle like this, even with your coupon, right? Which they discontinued coupons. How disappointing is that? But that's not the point here. So it's way more expensive at Hobby Lobby or Michaels. I don't know about Joann's, quite honestly. These are normally 582, which is already a great deal at Walmart. These came up today for between two and 250 a piece. Now, when I got home, I was really confused why at the register, it seemed like things were not all adding up as the same price. And I got home and realized that I, I technically had two tags and I did not even know it. So the one tag, the one bundle, I now can't find an example. I think it's this one. Yep, it's this one. This one has one more purple stock than this one. That's it. That was the difference. So three purple stocks were two fifty. Two purple stocks were two dollars. Walmart, you're killing me. But I love it, and I will continue to participate. So that is how you score a massive armful of floral, just like this, for less than twenty dollars. Now, is this my best? clearance haul florally from Walmart? No. I had another haul where I had more than 100 picks and stems and bouquets that rang up for only like $22.60 or something ridiculous. Like it was super low. But for being 
not after any specific season, not during a 90% seasonal clearance or anything like this. This is quite the hidden clearance pearl. So that is that for Walmart. And would it be a discount haul video if I didn't have at least gone to one Dollar Tree? Now, truthfully, I actually went to three Dollar Trees today. I am in search of a very specific truck which is ridiculous because I already have a lot of truck signs, but this one has watermelons and it is different. And I've been looking and looking and looking for it and I cannot find it and I will not stop till I find it. But they did have some other interesting things. A lot of these are repeats of items I'm already using for spring decor, but because this video will be going up before we do our huge garland decor decorate with me, if you're interested in crafting along, here are some of the supplies we will be using. So I realized because I decorate with this color so much year round, I might as well stock up on it while they have it in store. So I already had three other rolls of this deco mesh. Not gonna lie to you, Dollar Tree deco mesh is not the best in the industry. The best in the industry comes from Michaels. And I normally would tell you to use your 40% off coupon, but because we're not doing that anymore, we're gonna have to get creative. So we'll come back, we'll figure that out. But for $1, you get nine feet, oh, I'm sorry. You do not get nine feet, I lied. You get 15 feet. Uh, I personally do not believe that for a second and I likely will go measure this because I don't believe it. But allegedly we get 15 feet for a dollar. So that's that. Next up though, I love this one. This is a turquoise color burlap ribbon. You get, this probably lies to us too, I don't even know why I'm doing this. You get nine feet on this one um, of ribbon. That's all right for a dollar, not bad. Um, if you're buying huge quantities of ribbon though, Hobby Lobby is the place to go. Their ribbon is always 40% off. Don't ask me why, I don't understand how the economics of Hobby Lobby works and I studied economics in college. <laughs> I don't know how that place makes money. But point being, uh, if you're just using little bits of accent ribbon and you don't want a lot of excess ribbon laying around, Dollar Tree you can't go wrong with. The only problem is you have to find it when it's available, right? So. I know these colors are not gonna be back during the summertime. I plan to use a lot of turquoise in my summer decor, so I had to stock up while I stock up on it while they had it. So I officially have six rolls of this, and I do repurpose my ribbon and all of my burlap and everything else from season to season. I try not to cut it apart where I can, so these will get a lot of use from me. And then the last item I got from Dollar Tree today because they sadly did not have the truck that I'm so desperately searching for. Just kidding, I'm not really, not really that upset about it. Are these? And I've said before, this spring fling collection they came out with this year is really cute. I am doing a huge blooming wall in my stepdaughter's room, and I'll be making a video about that, so don't even worry. Um, but I thought that this was just gonna be like one of these hanging things. And it's not, it's six of them in here. They're just little paper cutouts, right? They're small, they're about the size of my hand, which I have really small hands. My hands are like kid sized, so they're small. But if you're using a bunch of them or if you need a ton of these for DIYs, this is a great value for a pre-printed, cute little butterfly hum, Oh, I'm sorry, it's just two different types of butterflies. I thought it had hummingbirds, but apparently it does not, whatever, it's fine. And then we've got some flowers, so this will be super, super cute to hang all over her wall. So I'm excited to use this in that upcoming video. And that, folks, does it. That's all the discounts I have for you today. Um, and I kind of put these videos up regularly because I go into Dollar Tree all the time. It's next door to my grocery store, and living in a small town we don't have a lot of entertainment so apparently our entertainment is we all go to Dollar Tree and see what treasures they brought so if you're interested in videos like these feel free to like subscribe and stick around for even more and I will see you for a DIY video in the next one thanks for coming bye